we would walk out from the living room onto this patio and then we would go out and we used to have chickens and we had a big garden back here and we were always outside playing I used to play wiffle ball with Eli back there that was the it's home plate was right there and the fence was a home run uh, it, it's just a beautiful area. I've been, you know, I've been across the United States and to other countries and it's like that. And we really have a, a beautiful area. You can, you know, be in the ocean in 15 minutes. You can be in the mountains. You can be at the lakes. And me as a police officer, I, I meet a lot of people from out of the area that come visit. And they go, oh, you live in a really special place. Uh, so it makes me feel good that we live here. Unfortunately, uh, we're, lately we've been having a lot of fires. Engine 4498, engine 5531, engine 26, oh, engine 17, water tender 17, station 21, what? vegetation fire. It progressively got worse. Um, units going at scene saying they have multiple acres that are well established and it was like, oh, you know, it, it ramped up really quick. I think everyone kind of knew that it could happen. We're just trying to be really ho hopeful that it wouldn't. Oh, the light. Do you fight for pride or glory? Do you hold your scars close to your heart? Oh, behind. Penguin is sitting here like you're at a delicatessen waiting for a sandwich, and we picked our number, and I think our number might be up today. Oh, no. On my way home, I basically just said, hey, you know, I'm going back to work, you know, told the family and kids I was leaving, kissed them goodbye and jumped in the truck and, and started um, heading home. Say, where's your backbone, brother? Where's your backbone, brother? Yeah.